I'm back again and today we are trying out to do, well I'm trying to do let's play <laughs> who knows if my computer can actually handle it because my laptop couldn't so I'm gonna have to do it on the computer so please do bear with the um, quality and the voiceover I have never done a let's play before so let's jump right into it as you can see this is my sim <laughs> made her pretty she's so pretty i wish i looked like that and she's got like these star wars buns i can't remember what her name is whatever her name is there's actually um, a hat for that anyway so i am doing the not so berry legacy challenge it's a challenge and it is by little simsy and always is it always simming or always simming it's one or the other i did find her channel i will link it below um i did go through the rules and not regulations but the rules and the idea of it in my speed build which i have built my own house i know i know and it's not a box i know <laughs> I will link that in the description as well if you want to go check that out. I'll do a quick, very, very, very quick run through because um, I don't want to basically repeat myself. So the aim of the game is to basically... <laughs> aim of the game because it's a game. Sorry. The aim of the challenge is to play with aspects that you might not necessarily do. And believe me, I don't do any of this because I like to live my best life on The Sims, which um, is not this. So... I do have a mini background for her as well. She is the first generation. Money doesn't matter. Like you can cheat your house and stuff, but I'm not gonna cheat throughout and I will be playing the game how I want to. So I'll be following certain rules while I'll just be playing how I want to basically. So what I find most enjoyable as well. Um, each generation is supposed to complete a career and their other rules which I'll go through in a second. Lifespan is on normal. Um, and yes, I'm thinking of doing this every Tuesday. We'll have a C because I am going home and I'll go through that at the end a little bit more. So this is the first generation, which is Mint. You're a mischievous scientist that really loves the colour Mint. You're career driven, but still make time for silly pranks and outings with your closest friends. You love luxury and want the best for yourself and your family. So this is her. This is Mint. This is Mint. She's going to be a scientist and this top, guys. Guys, can we just appreciate this top right now? It has a UFO on it. And I know it's like mostly pink and it's got some blue, but it has got like minty aspects, okay? I really tried with mint. Finding mint colours in the Sims is really hard, so there's going to be a mixture of green, blue, and like mint. <laughs> so you just got to deal with it. <laughs> yeah, this cute little top is like a UFO, and I was like, this is literally perfect for a scientist. She's not a mad scientist, she's more like a punky scientist so i have styled her like this how i would possibly want to dress if i could I'm not gonna lie and i love this bracelet that came in the sims as well i think that came with vampires i love that so much anyway so this is her in one of her outfits and she's got little cute space buns her aspiration is chief of mischief which means she's got this dastardly trait she is materialistic a vegetarian and jealous so yes we will see minty i've called her minty berry berry just makes sense because it's a berry challenge and you can call them berry as their last name i cannot for the life of me think of a first name for her so i've gone with minty as a nickname because guys because her background is that she was an orphan and now she's set out as an adult to go find her place in the world so she's got i'll go through it a little bit more with you but she liked to wear mint as when she was younger. So basically they nicknamed her Minty and it just stuck and that's what she's called now. She's called Minty guys, okay? She's called Minty. If you think of a better name, put it in the comments. But I've only done a couple of outfits. That's one. This is two. So I've kept it like not proper punk, like not really, really punk. They're pretty much the same. I do really love this dress. I love this dress so much. She looks so cute. Um, and then, yeah, I've just kept most of the dresses the same and I've used these tattoos because they're just perfect for science I thought and they have the right colours as well and I never use like these sort of back tattoos and stuff and I thought well she's punky let's do it and there you go look green because <laughs> we don't have anything else and I love these I love these I wear them all the time not me personally but I do like them and this is her uh, party outfit so I've gone a bit daring in some of the outfits 
bit daring. She's not bothered though. She's not bothered. And I've gone for this sort of old style swimsuit as well because her house kind of suits that style. And then her summer wear is this kind of minty. It's really cute actually and I really love this. I wish I could pull that off but I'm too uh, short in real life so that sucks. And then her snow wear. No, cold weather wear. <laughs> I know what I'm on about. And she's wearing nice little booties. And to top it off, she got herself a little cat. Ignore this. <laughs> Ignore this. I can't get rid of it. I don't know how to. When he's an adult, he won't have that. He'll have something else. But um, for now, that's, that's what he has, unfortunately. <laughs> yeah, so I chose a sphinx cat. And he will look more like this when he's older. Yeah. Got an angry... Uh, listen to his voice, listen to it. It's like an angry... So yeah, he's a boy and I decided he should be called Einstein because he's a scientist and it just makes sense. So I chose the Sphinx because it's um, naturally a clever cat apparently. If you click on his... If you go and click on it, it will always give you one trait. So it's a clever cat. So I decided to also give it a prowler and curious because these two also sort of link in with clever. And I thought that she would really want a, like a clever breed. But yeah, so we're going to start off with... <laughs> we're going to start off with little Einstein. And he's going to have this crescent mood because he's special. Okay, he's just special. Okay, and then let's just jump into game play. So I just showed you those things. So this is obviously an introduction, so it might be a bit boring. About the moment we're in Willow Creek because I wanted us to move. I'm just pretending that she used to live in Willow Creek. She's just standing out here thinking, where do I go? What do I do with my life? And now she wants to move to Strangerville. So let's move household. Let's do that. We're going to move to Strangerville because in my speed build, I mentioned that it just sounded really... It just sounds like the place a scientist would go. <laughs> Especially one that's like, like this, I don't know if anyone's done the scientist career, but it's very sort of mad science sort of inventions. And I just feel like Strangerville is the place to go. And we are going to use free real estate because you can cheat your first house. And uh, this is where we're gonna go live. No, we don't wanna keep that furniture, we'll sell it. And then we've got 6,000 left over. Might put that down a little bit, not sure. We'll see how we go. I need to buy some cat things first anyway, so. Like I said, money's not really the issue of the game, it's more about the gameplay. So, we will get into that as well when it loads. Mm, here we go. So this is why I didn't want to um, move in and start straight away, because I wanted to show you her outfits and stuff, and this obviously pops up. And I thought, depending on time frame, depending on how the let's play plays out i was thinking we could do this as like an add-on she could ignore it and she could be part of the scientist sort of area or she could like try and solve it because she's all about you know free will and good if you like that idea um put it down in the comments basically so it says welcome to strangerville the only thing stranger than the people is the flora soon after moving in the town slogan is starting to make sense to you some of the locals are acting a bit suspicious and there's a large number of military and scientists in town see we're gonna fit in try asking people about strangeville they might be able to shed, shed some light on this strange situation there we go and there's our little kitty i'm gonna pick him up because when they're kittens they can't, go on, you can do it, do it, do it. When they're kittens, they can't climb the stairs. It's really annoying. Right, pause, because she'll put him down otherwise. And we'll go over here and we'll put him there. So while she does that, I will show you the house. So if you've watched the speed build, you can just skip this, but I'm not going to go over it for ages. So this is like a porch area, I've got this outdoor seating area, which is really cute, it's so cute. And this is the house in general. So, I mean, I put a lot of effort in. At least it's not a box, right? <laughs> At least it's not a box. This is her new office. And this is a dining area, kitchen, living room. Um, weird room, if you've watched the speed world, dude, I know. Uh, and then there's a bathroom 
And then there's another little seating area here as well, which I thought was quite nice. Obviously, she's got a pool and a hot tub because why not? She likes luxury. She's been an orphan for however long. I have no idea where she got this money from, by the way. We've just... <laughs> we've just decided that. <laughs> when I say we, I mean me. Um, she's got the chess table because that's part of her rules. And then I put this here because it was just... It was really big, not much room. I decided to give her this. And we want to change the colour of these lights actually because I don't like I don't like that yellow. I like a more yes. Perfect. And what we will try and do, auto lights doesn't always work for me because it um kind of ruins my game a little bit. Anyway, these rooms are empty because she wants to have a kid and stuff, and that's her bedroom and her bathroom. So that's everything. She is obviously doing that by playing a game i think what i want her to do first is join a career so i haven't gone through her rules obviously she needs to complete the scientist career and her aspiration which is chief of mischief and she also needs to master the mischief and logic skills which sort of makes sense i don't think you can complete the mischief chief of mischief without mastering that skill and then also complete the elements collection and unfortunately i don't think strange feels very good for completing the elements collection but we will give it a go we'll give it a go i have got some custom careers in here as well which i'm not really sure if they work that well but anyway scientists and it's one of those unfortunate playable ones oh effort so here we go we need to have a breakthrough so a really good way to have a breakthrough is reading let's why is there so many of these books why are they like double oh okay well she's gonna like the sound of this orbital pudding a mountain sized glob of coconut pudding is lobbed into orbit to study its potential for sustaining life on other planets i feel like she would really enjoy that like a lot like a lot a lot a lot so we need to complete this where is she going? Oh, to that one. Why? Why? <laughs> Why? It's right there. Okay. So, Chief of Mist. Ooh. There we go, yeah. Oh, yeah, we should get an umbrella. What sort of umbrella would you choose? Let's take an umbrella at some point as well. Ooh. What would she choose? None of these are like her colours. Um. Um, I would say green, but oh, it's gonna be green, isn't it? All right, fine, green. Green it is. Green it is. Mm -mm -mm. She's multitasking because she can, and it's really hot. Oh, that's a thought. Let's go on to the holidays. Yeah, so I started it in summer because I thought, why not? Um, I want to add in Halloween. I love Halloween. Everyone's probably laughing at me. I don't know why this isn't even added in as a natural holiday. Not natural, but a holiday. Because The Sims is American and I feel like they should do it. I usually pick this one, but I recently downloaded more icons. So, <laughs> I um, I haven't looked through them all, really. So there's another pumpkin one. Oh, well, there's only way too much time on this, I know. What is that? Huh? Um... Oh, that's a potion, so I like that. And another bat. Oh yeah, some of them aren't working. That's really weird. What is that? It's a dress. Why would you <laughs> pee yourself, day? That sounds perfect. That's what I want. Halloween. Uh, 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 uh. It's got carving a pumpkin. Or what is that? That's like pumpkin massacre. Oh my god, divorce holiday. What? shit yourself day so i do well that's bloody creepy <laughs> that's really creepy what else have we got oh, i like this one it's like a wellness one i like that okay oh that's nice all right i'm just gonna go with the standard one i can imagine using some of those for other weird holidays oh, we'll just go for that one because it's got a witch hat on i like it i don't like it so what do I usually do? I usually do decorate, because you can, that's not just Christmas, is it? Oh, colour. Yeah, that's fine. And then, most of them are down. Spooky spirit. 
trick or treat offs wear costumes yes. and sometimes i like to do remembrance but you can't complete this without someone being dead so <laughs> which really sucks um because traditionally halloween is when the veils of the living and the undead are very very close together so you can it's a good time basically to remember your ancestors and try to contact them and stuff like that so that's why i would like to add that one but it's not gonna work so we'll leave it maybe i'll do oh it's gonna be a heat wave maybe i'll do like a barbecue day like a summer holiday summer holiday and we will take the day off because you know why not right we need a summer holiday one oh i might just skip this because this is taking a lot longer than i thought it would actually um i'm taking way too much time to see this oh new ball new baby day oh these might be good just a sunny day. yeah we'll just do a sun and we'll do a barbecue and we'll do drinking because why not fire mm -mm -mm. Mm -mm -mm. not grand meal she'll be like bloody stuffed maybe a party spirit thankful spirit watch no romantic tv shrieky oh water fun yes there we go so we have a holiday have that and then we have harvest first which really should be the other way around i don't know how oh, bobs all out though and then we've got christmas new year's and love day so we might do an easter around here as well but i don't want to take up all the time so let's do this let's hope that the welcome wagon decides to come welcome wagon welcome wagon oh yeah i need to get cat stuff don't i <gasps> that's perfect look i could put a little cat tray there perfect perfect let's do that We want, we want a litter tray. Might as well get this one. <gasps> Does it, oh, it comes in a mint colour. Mate, that's perfect. Mint colour and everything. Where should we put the food? Like here? I feel like that's where it should go. Are these coming any like mint colours? Oh, this does. There you go. And they don't have like... Um... <laughs> water bowls for some reason because you know pets don't need water to be fair cats get their water from wet food so if they're drink if they're eating a lot of dry food or you only feed them dry food then they will need water but yeah i just thought i'd let everyone know <laughs> don't know why i bothered but i did okay i did and i like having a mat underneath it because if you have a cat or a dog you know they like to make a lot of mess and it's just like, what are you doing? Why? Why do you need to make so much mess? My cat does all the time and I have no idea why. She's just like, yep, I know you just clean the floor and everything, but I need to eat off the floor, Soz. Soz, where are the mats? Am I blind? Okay. I don't want to put a welcome mat down because that's weird. That's not it, is it? No. Maybe I'll just use this. Oh, right now it's really annoying. Mm, yeah. I don't like it. Is there a white version? There's a grey version. That's kind of white. Ugh, don't like that. There's a better mat that I want. Okay. So we'll just, we'll just leave it for now. Leave it for now. Okay. And then maybe we could put like a little cat bed here. Little cat tree, little cat tree. They don't really use them, so I might just put a normal cat bed down. I might use this one. That green egg. I do like green eggs and ham. I do. And then maybe put that just next to it. It's really far away, so move that in a bit. There we go. And that's our cat sorted. That's our cat sorted. Right, are we 
going to be getting... Oh, here we go. Welcome, Ryan. Are you going to hurry up? Oh, she's had her first breakthrough. Nice. Nice. Right, put that down then and go introduce yourself to this creep. <laughs> I do like the way that they walk around. It is really creepy. And the, the ticks that they have. Oh, it's weird. Here she is. She's like, you okay? Okay, you're a freak. <laughs> I don't think you can... Actually, can you talk to... No, you can't talk to any of these people. Go away, Ted. No one wants your fruitcake. Bloody fruitcake. Oh, door's in the way now. Uh, I'll just see now. <laughs> oh, they all like this. So you can't really talk to them. Oh, you can snap them out of it. Oh, okay, we'll try that. We'll try and talk to Ted anyway. Water is love, water is life. I mean, she's not wrong. Water is life. Water is life. She's just like, please leave me alone. Creeps. Maybe I'll snap Ted out of it. Oh my gosh, she's slapping her. Is that how they slap him out of it? Oh, did it work? No, it didn't. No. Nope, didn't work for any of them. Well, can I take the fruitcake? I don't really want to invite you in. I'm not gonna lie. Sure. Okay. Go away. Weirdos. Leave. Leave my house. Right, let's go. Feed Einstein. We will feed Einstein. What else do we need to do? So we need to do this, but those people, we couldn't talk to those people. Oh yeah, so she's in the orphanage and I thought she needs to have some sort of childhood traits because otherwise she's just a nobody. So I've given her responsible because I feel like she would recognise the situation that she was in and wants to do better. So she was responsible, she got good grades. And I thought, stereotypically, um, and I, I don't want to offend anyone, but stereotypically people are more emotionally not necessarily controlled, but they don't show their emotion as much, so I thought maybe that's what she could do as well. Oh, maybe we can find some thingies. Um, no, I don't want to take a picture of the plant. Um, actually, no, let's continue because some of them, they spawn, don't they? <gasps> There's one! There's one there! Yes! Yes! Queen. I think this video is going to be a bit longer than usual just because I jabbered on at the beginning. So I'm looking to about 20 to 30 minutes per episode, but we're at 23 now. Oh, there's another one. So I'm thinking maybe this episode could be 40. And then just because you haven't seen any gameplay, like I haven't played anything yet. And it's a bit like I should have. So sorry. <laughs> sorry about that. I like to talk, I'm afraid. I like to talk. Let's not see, this is what I mean, there's not really much out here. Oasis Springs is always a good place to start because there is loads out there. I've already gone for that one, haven't I? I think so. This is a nice house. I think that's where I put um, Ted and his wife because I was like, nah, bitch, I want your house. Well, I want this spot anyway. So that's what I did. I moved them because... Look at you, great toast! Um, yeah, there's, there's nothing. Okay, well, here she is. Oh, it looks like a hot day, I'm not going to lie. It looks like a hot day. Can you hurry up? Okay. What did we get? Oh. Oh. And it's not even a good one. See, I don't mind these if there's if one of them's a scientist, because then I'm like, oh, perfect, you know, it fits in my house. But it's not okay. Let's travel. Okay, let's go to the bar. Why not? Okay, we are here at Eight Bells. We are at Jabar. Oh, you're looking like you're in the sunshine. Look at you! I've never seen you. Oh, <laughs> with his glasses. 
I don't, I don't really like this. I really don't. Like, I don't, I just don't like it, okay? Let's go talk to Sunglasses guy. Let's be friendly to him. Oh, okay, he's coming to us, is he? Oh, it's not Don for once! Every time I've come here to play test, because obviously I've never done this before and I wanted to make sure it was okay, it was always Don. Um, let's get to know him. We should, like, turn on. What sort of music do I listen to here? Jazz? No. Uh, oh, strange tunes! What does strange tunes sound like? Doesn't sound that weird. Like, at all. Let's discuss interests. Who even are you? Ali. Kafki? Is that right? Right, we need to do mischief. Let's do mischief while we're here. Let's hear us about aliens first. Oh. And then we will. Let's. Let's. Uh, 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 uh. Let's ask what's that spot. She's got a drink. When did she buy that? Did she just. I love her hair. We need to be friends with her. Oh, he didn't like that. Maybe he doesn't like this, Jeff. Maybe it didn't work. Let's trick him with the hand buzzer. Maybe it was too advanced. Go away. I'm now offline for some reason. <laughs> Don't need to be online right now. Can you... Is she okay? Where can I hide as an awkward conversation? She really needs a toilet, actually. Did you say hello? Where are the toilets here? Oh, it's just this massive room. <gasps> let's do it, let's do it. Trick on the hand buzzer. Do it, do it, do it, do it, do it. Go, girl. Yes. Worked. Haha! <laughs> because fuck it, does. <laughs> I want this person to be our friend. Bridget. Let's get to know her. I like her hair. I oh, he's leaving. <laughs> he's leaving. He was like, fuck this person in particular. <laughs> Don't like her. Uh, let's ask her. I mean, it's pretty obvious what career she's in to me, but we'll ask her anyway. Jesse, you never know. Maybe she's just playing dress up for the day. Uh, where's get to know? And go, we'll get to know her as well. And are you gonna hurry up and pee? It takes so long to go to the toilet. I mean, I take a long time to go to the toilet, but she's neat. Oh, I can always use a neat friend. Let's talk about vegetarian benefits and do an impression. Of... Oh, where's she going? Oh, we're here. Okay. Mm. Maybe we should lie about our career because I don't know. Oh, I just missed that. Hey, is that Victor Feng? Look at those socks. Uh, she's a sergeant main, a uh, sergeant minor. Is that a real thing? I don't know anything about uh, military careers. I'm afraid, so I don't actually. She looks really sad. Let's do more mischief. Let's invite her to a fake party. Like, hey, I'm totally thinking of having a party later. Do you want to come? And she's just like, yeah. So maybe that's how she makes friends. She, like, lies a little bit. She starts a rumour. I don't think she liked that. No, she doesn't like that either. Oh, I don't... Is she in our conversation? Fuck off. Fuck off. I did not invite you into this conversation. Let's ask her about her day. Oh, don't leave. Don't leave us. Come back. We wanted to be friends. I wanted to be your friend. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Uh, no, I don't do romance. I just want to be a friend. Should we scare her? Maybe she's like one of those people that's like tough love. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. And what's that? Blue. Oh, I don't work. Does it count if it doesn't work? No? No? Oh, it does. It counts. It just makes us embarrassed, though. It's really sad. 
Let's not argue about Kerry. We want her to be our friend. Let's see the fake bad news. <laughs> fake news. That's fake news. That's Arsa Kalkes. That's a oh, she's sad. What envious? It's hard. To what? It's hard to see other couples together when you don't have anyone special in your life. Oh, she wants someone to be with. I suppose that makes sense. Oh, that was really sad. Who's the couple? I don't know. Ted's there. Is his wife there? What's his wife called? I don't know. What's Ted's last name? Roswell. Is that her? Oh yeah. Okay. Maybe that's why. Let's try and get our friendship up a little bit. She's sad as well now because... I don't know. <laughs> I mean, I understand you want to not be lonely. You're a cat. You don't need friends. You don't need a man in your life or woman. That person's sad too. Maybe... Oh, she just walked right through me. I'm still a person, guys! They're having a good time. Are we friends yet? Is she leaving? Let's ask her advice. Let's share her insecurities. I want to see what she looks like normally without this outfit on. Uh, isn't there like a, yeah, ask the outfit. Let's go for every day. Because that's not her every day, surely. Maybe it is. Show me! Oh, she looks pretty. I mean, it actually kind of matches for once. That's probably one of the better outfits I've seen. <laughs> Complain about our problems, that's what friends are for. Oh! She's leaving. Nope. Maybe she's thinking... Oh, she seemed really sad, maybe I should stay. Even though we're not friends. We're acquaintances. They were near friends. Who's this? What do you want? <laughs> hey. <laughs> that's what that looked like to... Hey. Let's have a friendly interruption, I suppose. We can be mean to her. Oh yeah, it's guys' night. Gentlemen, students can slaughter up for the bar and for discount drinks. Oh what? Oh what? We could meet some guys, and then she might be lonely. Have I said hello? Oh, have to get to know her, and then I think. She's in a club. Let's be. Let's do some mischief on this person because she looks miserable. She looks like the sort of person that would look down on us. So let's be not necessarily mean, but just a bit like taking a piss because we don't really like her that much. I don't like her when people look down on me anyway. So <laughs> I think I'm projecting too much into this. Oh, she's stressed. We've made her stressed. Let's do the what's this spot one. I want to see what that is. Oh. <laughs> oh, we have to be disliked. Okay. Let's be disliked by her. Let's be mean. Let's yell at her. Like, why do you think you're looking down on me, bitch? I know what you're doing. Shout for bitter words. Yes, because we all know that I swear a lot. Even though this isn't me. <gasps> oh, Vlad. I love Vlad. Let's be friends with Vlad. Oh, she seems really... She's angry. Let's give her a mean gift. What's a mean gift? Oh, nice wrapping paper though. <laughs> That's funny. Uh, should I shove her? Ooh, this is getting brutal. Shove her. Do it. Day. Oh my gosh. She's like, guys, we could be friends. <laughs> She's like, this is not a nice conversation. Let's argue with her about her career, which I don't know. I don't like the fact that you have a career that I don't know about. Well, maybe if you asked, you would know what it was. Gosh, it's all about you, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> argue about music just be like you look like the type of person that wouldn't like proper music I have no idea what the music is but we need to be disliked that's quite high isn't it Ooh. No. we're just arguing so much just jeer her I don't know what that means dislike me 
What's her name? Mila. Um, Mila Munch. Let's Will you just dislike me, please? Implied mother is a llama. Gonna do anything? No, I'm just gonna walk. Okay, we're gonna stand by side by side. What's she doing? Chat. Oh, she's talking about money. Oh, I need to look at my thingies. Oh, yes, well, I do have a lot of money, yes. <laughs> fight her! Let's fight her. Go. She might win. But I could win. I look athletic and I. <gasps> Oh my gosh. Oh, I'm disliked by her now. Fighting probably does that. Physical fighting, anyway. Are we gonna win? Are we gonna win? Oof. Da -da -da. Oh no. I think we lost. We lost. Now we're dazed. That's sad. <laughs> when do we have work, anyway? In 12 hours, we should probably go home then. What's she doing? Hear about Mia's career. She's lying to me about her career! Bitch! No, I won't beg for forgiveness. I don't think I believed her. I was like, no, you're a liar. You are a liar. Okay, well, let's go home. We'll be like, we're so dazed. We need to go home. Hmm. Okay. Let's try and have one more. Where's uh, Einstein? Oh yeah, I forgot I can click on him. Oh, he's waiting for us. Oh, that's sad. Let us. Get to know him because for some reason we don't know our own cat. We'll give him a hug. Let's play with him. We'll give him a tree as well and then we'll play with him. With the laser pointer. Go. Do you want to do anything? Oh, again, no oh. Oh. oh, wait, pause it. Oh, damn it. She was like strangling him. Look. She's like, I could totally do this. <laughs> My god. That's evil. Where's she going? What? Why? What are you doing? What are you doing? Oh, she's hungry as well. What are you doing? Apparently she's playing, but through the door. What the fuck? <laughs> I suppose that's one way to do it. Okay, well, I'm going to send her bed and it's nearly 40 minutes already. Then not much really happened in this episode, which is really, really sad. So hopefully next episode we can actually go to work and get more done on this. And I'll need to do her needs and stuff. But yeah, if you like this, give this a thumbs up, guys. And I will see you all hopefully next week. I will have to be recording... Uh, these in advance because I am going home so unfortunately I won't get much feedback but you can still give feedback and then we could just sort things out when I get home again so yeah thanks for watching guys if you liked it subscribe comment and like and I will see you all again next week bye